Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to Raft. It's been quite a long time since we played. The uh, the in-game menu as I was loading in told me that it's actually been about two months since we played. So surprise, surprise, I'm probably going to relearn a little bit of the game, but there is some stuff that we didn't we didn't complete last time, and I know they've had a few updates since the last time I played, so I thought it'd be kind of neat to jump in here and play again, see what kind of new stuff's been added. No, there's apparently some new building pieces they've put in place, so we can add some different shapes and things on the raft. Uh, they are working on some updates around uh, adding some larger islands as well as a new enemy and some uh, some fish and stuff that are going to be under the water too that we'll have to watch out for that'll be a little bit dangerous. What I want to try and tackle today though is uh, building the radio equipment. So there is supposed to be like a, a radio setup uh, that can lead us to something like uh, like an, an oil platform or something of that nature. And so that's what I want to go on the hunt for today. Um, now I'm pretty much... I'm, well, you know what, let's take all this wood out of here. Um... I was working on making some raw metals and stuff the last time here. So we get some of that going. Uh, we're going to cook up some food, make sure we're all set up there. We did build the, the, the larger water purifier last time, if you remember. It's been a while, so you may not. Uh, but um, this is giving us a fantastic amount of fresh water to drink and takes, like, no effort at all because it doesn't take any wood, which is great. So I can spend those, uh, those wood resources on other things. Uh, now, I don't have any seeds planted. Uh, we probably should deal with that. Uh, I don't even know if I have any arrows on me. Yeah, okay, so I have 11 arrows on me. What do we got here? We got some black seeds, red seeds. These are all flowers. I'm not worried about that. We have palm seeds, mango seeds. Both of those are being trees and can't make those just yet. These are all flowers as well. See, these are flowers themselves. I think you may use these to make, like, paints and stuff so you can color your raft. Uh, we have the actual food in here, so that's okay. You know what? We have some beets on us. I guess I could... We got all kinds of cooked beets. Look at all this cooked food in here. This is crazy. Man, I don't have to cook any food for a little while, actually. Uh, I'm going to put this bolt in here. Get that out of my inventory. Uh, copper. And then we have metal ore. So these are two things that I'm currently in the process of smelting right now. I'm not going to worry about the paddle either. We'll store that. So I think my objective today is going to be to try and gather up some more materials, if I can actually remember how to actually hit things with this rook. There we go. Now, we're going to gather up some more materials, because we have lots of things to build. I want to expand on the raft, hopefully try to build up some space so we can actually start to uh, grow some trees and stuff, so that we're not always hunting for wood in the water. Get the equipment built for the radio equipment, and then maybe see if we can find that, uh, that fancy oil platform. All right, I'm just taking a look at what we actually need to build this equipment. So there's uh, there's a radio receiver in the antenna that we're going to need to make. Uh, and there's also this this anchor that we can make that will allow us to drop anchor and drop back in again without having to constantly like build a new one all the time. So I feel like that would be really, really handy. I kind of want to get one of those built. Um, now that we need three metal ingots, four rope planks, and then a hinge. Um, this one's probably realistic to make because we have the metal ingots. But in order to make... The receiver and the antenna, we need to make circuit boards, which require copper. And I don't have much copper. I mean, I made a, I made a single copper ingot. Uh, and that was all I had available to me. So we have just the one copper ingot. We have we do have three of the metal ingots, though. So if we take those. Uh, we go over here. We're going to need... What else was it this thing needed for the anchor? Planks, rope. So let's get our planks. Uh, rope. We can make some more rope with that. Uh, the hinge, I think I stuck in here somewhere. There we go. Got a couple, couple hinges. Okay. Um, all right. Where's the anchor? Okay, we got that. Nice. Okay, so we finally got an anchor that we could reuse. Which is great. Stationary anchor. Let's see anchor your raft. Um, what are, oh, wow. That is not a small thing. <laughs> all right. This is not... Not entirely what I was anticipating. Uh, I mean, I can put it in here and get rid of one of our little collection things. I kind of don't want to do that, though. I'd rather have it, like... Oh, actually, this is all red. I can't put it there. I need to put it somewhere where it's going to turn white, I guess. Do I have to create an opening for this thing? It looks like I have to create an opening in the floor. Otherwise, I can't even put this thing down. Um, so that's going to be a fun task. Okay, so I'm thinking, like, if I could put the anchor, like, right here in the front... That'd be really handy. This storage container um, has stuff in it. <laughs> Not stuff that I really need, but it's got stuff in it. Um, let's try to grab it if we can out here. Let's grab the shell. Seeds. Oh, I do have more copper. 
Sweet. All right, so we might actually be able to build the circuit. Come on, get out of here, Bruce. Evil Bruce. Um, hold on. How do we repair his stuff here again? Repair. There we go. Okay, that's all fixed. Rock Bruce always chewing on my raft. Okay, so I do have copper in here. I didn't realize I had all that. Uh, so that's a good thing. Let's get stuff out of here. Shift these into farther. You know what? Maybe we can put them over here. Yeah, this seems more reasonable. With the plastics in here. Um, get this and stuff out of the road. Maybe we can empty a couple of these things. I must have stones in here somewhere. Oh, there's the clams. I actually can grab the giant clam from here. Uh, put stones in here. Yeah, fill up a little flowers, why not? Ooh, we do have vine goo also. We do need that for the circuit board, which is great. So with copper we need for the circuit board, of course. Uh, seeds and stuff I don't need on me right now. This can go in there. Okay, perfect. So let's go make some more copper, too. So we have our giant, uh, our giant anchor set up. Now I just need to get, get some more copper running in here. This is going to be great. Okay. So up front now, I'm going to remove this. Uh, at least I thought I was going to. Now I can remove it. And then our large anchor... Oh, it kind of kind of jitters between spots. Hopefully it will let me anchor it this way, because it's kind of overhanging my little collection spot. Oh, come on. Um, I think we need to chop it. Is that how we get rid of this stuff? Yeah, there we go. So now we got a hole in our raft. Uh, I do want this toward the front, though, because if we drop anchor, I want to pull it. There we go. Oh, that's awesome. Ha! Ah, perfect! <laughs> we have an anchor. So now I don't have to build one every time I want to stop my raft, which is probably a good thing. This is not really the prettiest raft in the world, but as long as it gets the job done, I guess. All right, another ingot. Uh, so that's two ingots. The circuit board requires two ingots each. So, okay, we can make our first circuit board. Amazing. We have enough vine you to make another one, so we just really need the copper. Um, so let's go and look at... The receiver first, maybe? No, I need two circuit boards for the receiver. For the antenna, I need one. So we can make an antenna first. I do have bolts also. We kind of got a few things sort of squared away to get all this stuff ready last time, and I just didn't get around to building it, I guess. Um, what was the hinge thing? Did I use all three hinges? Oh, oh wait, this is the bolt I want. That's what I want. All right. All right receiver, antenna, craft. How big is it? Oh, it's a big antenna. Okay. Um, I guess we'll put it, I don't know, over here? I'm going to need to build, like, a table or something, too. Something we can put our fancy receiver on. Oh, there's an island. Oh, we missed it. Oh, well, I guess, I mean, we aren't really hard up for anything at the moment anyway. We're gathering a lot of supplies and stuff as we sail. So I'm not really in a huge rush, and we do have enough copper here to do what I need. Um... Okay, so in the meantime, I think I'm going to build a staircase we can get up to the second floor on our raft here. Uh, that's going to need to rotate. And apparently I can't build there. Why can't I build there? That's, that makes no sense to me. I can't, I can't see what the top is going up to because I'm... My, oh, you know what? I'm just not carrying the materials I need. Because I'm smart. <laughs> Okay, we need planks and stuff. Put those in here somewhere. Where's my planks? There we go. Have some planks. Have some nails. Now we can build our stairs. Uh, I'm going to put those behind here. Perfect. Now we can get up top side. Uh, we're going to need a lot more materials, obviously, to build the, the layer up here. But this is kind of where I want to put, like, trees and stuff if I can. Oh, Bruce. I saw you coming this time. That's right. In your face. Oh, here we go. So, foundations, uh, wooden floor is what we want. So, we're going to build those up here. That gives us that layer. And I can't build out anymore this way. Nor can I build at the back. It looks like we hit our limit. That's crazy. Uh, we're going to go farther with that side, but then that's going to be... I don't know. It's not going to match up properly. I don't want that. Uh, we do need to make some more support pillars at the back and probably some more foundation pieces, I guess. If I want this upper level to be larger. So we'll throw some more of these back here. 
like I said, for, fortunately we got we got quite a few materials as we're kind of sailing around because there's a lot of stuff. Uh, I need nails for these. Why you need nails? I don't know. I mean, they're just straight posts. Uh, how do I make nails again? Oh, scrap. Oh, that's easy enough. Okay. Right, we got we have nails, a whole pile of them. So we're gonna do here. Try to match these up, I guess. Uh, okay, let's not fall in the water. <laughs> the rafting was pretty quick. I don't want to be swimming back behind my raft. All right. That gives us room for more ceiling pieces. Man, I got more materials than I thought I did. Sweet. But still, we need more. All right, back up top side. We'll finish this off. Hopefully, this should give us enough. No! <laughs> it takes a serious amount of materials to build things on this raft. All right, we managed to get a few more a few more planks in place now. I found a little bit more of the junk kind of floating on the water. I don't know if we have enough to make what I need to yet, though. Oh, we do. Just barely enough. Look at that. We have our receiver made. Um, now, I don't have enough to make a table. <laughs> I kind of feel like we probably want to put the receiver on a table. Right? Maybe. Oh, it has its own table. Oh, sweet. All right. That's perfect. We don't need it then. So we're going to put that right here. Battery required. No! All right. How do we make batteries? Um, battery. Copper ingot. Plastics and scrap. Uh, we need more wood. So I'm going to gather up some more supplies uh, because I'm going to need I need wood in order to smelt some more ingots. Now I do have I do have one more one more thing of copper ore that'll give us the ingot that we need to make that. So that'll be perfect. I'm, I'm happy that we finally found the trash again. Never thought I'd say that. We're back at the stream of trash and we have uh, we have more supplies all showing up every moment we sail along. So that's great. This will get us re-equipped in no time. Hey, right, I've been gathering some materials again. Uh, I actually had to build a new scrap hook because the one I had broke on me. But we should have enough to make a streamer now. So the rope we can make, that's fine. Uh, the nails, I think I'll put some away over here. We can grab some of those. Let's make a streamer so we can finally see where we're going. In terms of the wind. No, I don't want to do that. Uh, did I accidentally build it? I might have. I might have. I have shark meat too I need to grill. Um, let's try and get some wood in here. I think we can put like three pieces of shark meat on here at once. Oh yeah, that's amazing. Oh, tasty shark. Okay, in here we have the streamer we crafted. We'll throw that down on the deck. How big is this thing? Oh, oh I can see the direction the wind's going. That's funny. So this will show... Oh, wait a minute. Maybe that's not really the wind. Maybe that's just like a default position. I'm going to put this right at the front of the raft. Nope, that is the direction of the wind. There is an island over there. Um, but that's not my primary concern right now. I want to make a battery. Because the battery is going to let us power our fancy equipment. And see where it leads us. Gotta purify more water. Alright. That's all good. Uh, more metal ingots. Just might as well keep making these. All right, battery is going to take. Where are we? Copper ingot, uh, plastic, and scrap. I think I made a copper ingot. Didn't I? No. Ah, oh, rat. I put metal in here, and I meant, <laughs> meant to put copper in. Let's try and maybe veer over towards this uh, this island over here. We can kind of park for a little bit. Finish building the stuff we need to. We'll get our bearings and then figure out where we need to go following the crazy receiver and whatever that stuff is. The radio equipment. Uh, okay, let's throw our anchor down. Drop anchor. That seems to work pretty quick. Sweet. <laughs> the best part is I didn't have to craft and waste materials on another anchor. Uh, throw that in there. Get this going. I'm rubbing against the uh, rubbing against the rock. It sounds like a shark. It always throws me off. 
Okay, so if we... Now, apparently, I was trying to build stairs in here before, but I guess the real trick here is to use uh, slope ceiling pieces. So if we go into ceilings, we can build these up, like, infinitely, basically. And it doesn't require any extra support. At least that's what I heard. Uh, rotate. Do I not have the materials? I guess I don't. Hold on, where's all my... Where's all the wood? Oh, Bruce. Come on, I'm busy, buddy. Aw, oh, you broke my raft, too, you rotten shark. Alright, I'm going to leave that for now. Alright, so there's another piece. Oh, yeah, this works great. At least it did until I ran out of materials. <laughs> no! I didn't... I even made the cautious decision not to repair that thing back there, but... Alright. Um, that's not even... <laughs> That's not even close enough. If I if I have this a little closer to the front, I guess I can I can probably get this. So maybe we can get the wood back. So hopefully we get all the material back and not only half, because that would really suck. I have a feeling it's only half we get back. Okay, I rotate that. Oh, we only got like half back. Ugh, stinks. I seriously need to get some trees growing on this thing. I need to kill this shark so we can get out there and get... You know what? Uh, let's get it. Let's get some stuff to eat. And then... Uh, mount out on this. And then I'm just going to go in the water anyway. I'll have our spear handy. We'll battle it out with Bruce in the water while I try and swim over there and get the materials we need. Now, we can go pretty quick. If I can give... Actually, if I can give Bruce a little poke here. Alright, this might give me a chance to get away. Now, I, I I could build a shark bait and try to keep him distracted, but... I want to try to save the shark bait for if I'm actually going to go in the water around the island and try to hunt for stuff. Oh! Thought I heard him. <laughs> the shark scares me. I know it's only a game, but honestly... God. Okay. Uh, wood, wood. Give me wood. Now, fortunately, we have our flippers and stuff, so we are moving faster than I would normally. I think if we can see him coming, if I can figure out where he is. There he is. Come on, shark. I have my dive ball and everything, I think, equipped. So if I can see him coming... And we could jab him, then we might be able to stop him from biting us. Come here, you. Come on, shark. Oh, that did not work. I either didn't time it right, or... Oh, we came all the way over to this raft. All right. <laughs> as long as we're here, let's get out of the water for a minute. Or a second, anyway. Things going to sink as soon as I jump on it, but... Uh, wait, can I crouch? Come on, let me... Let me... No! No! Up the ramp. Grab the supplies. Swim for it! It's very dark out now. All right. Uh, so we have 13 wood now. That's just, That should give us enough to get up on top of the island. And then, of course, we'll be able to get more trees up there. And that'll give us all the supplies we need, I think. All right. There we are. So it's going to look super weird. But it does get us up on the island, so that's good. Ooh, watermelons. Well, that was handy. I didn't realize I could... I wasn't sure I was going to be able to get him off the raft there just with the, with the bow, but that worked great. Unless he took out a corner floor there. I think he might have. <laughs> he might have broken my floor and then left. I think I'm going to take credit for him leaving, but he just took off on his own. Okay. Battery. Uh, plastic and scrap I need. Scrap, plastic, craft. Nice. Okay. Place the battery... Turn it on. Requires higher altitude. What? Oh, come on. How high do I have to build this thing up? All right. Um, all right, turn that off, I guess. Pick up the battery. Jeez. How do I remove this thing? Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Remove that. Remove the antenna. 
I guess we'll put this on the upper floor. I was really kind of thinking I could just have it down bottom, but I guess it's not going to work. Alright. Take two. Come on, work for me this time. There we go. Place our battery. Turn it on. Ah, there we go. Oh. Oh, man. Okay, so the receiver can't be this close to things. Um, well, that's a thing. I guess we got to remove it. I thought it had to be right next to it, but I guess the idea is to have it sort of spaced out. Uh, we'll put antenna one down here. Apparently, I'm going to need a whole lot more copper because we're going to need more antennas. And those all require circuit boards. Wrong altitude. Oh. Killing me, game. Okay, so I have to have them spaced out, but they also have to be elevated. So put the first one back here, I guess. It's ruining my tree farm. Okay, there. Antenna one is working. Okay, we got this. Make, some, make sure we get the floor finished up here. Okay, that's all done. Uh, all right, so we need we need more antenna, which means we're going to need to have some more copper, which means we're going to have to dive down under the water to go in search of it. Against the shark. What do we need for the antennas exactly? The antennas, I think, were just a single circuit board. Yeah, each circuit board, of course, takes two copper, so we're going to need at least four more... Four more copper to smelt if we're going to have any luck getting this thing up and running and actually tracking down this crazy thing we're hunting for. All right, you shark. I wonder if I could shoot the bow under the water at the shark. Oh, he just swam through the rock. That's cheating. All right, whatever. I'm going to go after the copper. Uh, copper is down pretty deep. So we're going to have to swim down the side of the mountain here. Or the mountain, the island, whatever it is. Try to find it down here. Actually, that's metal. Not worried about metal right now. I just want copper. There we go. Fortunately, we can harvest it pretty quick. Man, there's actually metal down here, too. Okay. It took way too much work, <laughs> but I've got the last antenna built. That's antenna number three. Now, I wonder if I could actually use four of them. Oh, look at the way the wires spread across. I wasn't really expecting that. All right, we have all four antenna, or all three antennas ready. Oh, look at the eggs. Nice. Eggs, feathers. Soon we'll be able to make a hammock. That'll be sweet. Okay, let's turn this thing on and see what happens. Ooh, it works. Okay, we need to head that away. Whatever that way that was. Anyway, let's get the anchor up. Uh, let's get this turned accordingly. <laughs> I need to turn this thing off because I'm wasting battery power. Actually, the, the position changed really quickly there. I wonder how close this thing is. All right, we'll see. It's off that way somewhere. We're getting closer to this thing. The distance is now only 364, 363. We're getting, we're moving towards it rapidly. I've already cut that distance in half, which is great. Um, I'm wondering at what point we'll be able to see this thing. So I don't see anything yet. We are floating through a lot of junk, though, at least, so we're collecting a little bit of stuff, but... And I haven't had to replace the battery yet, too, which is good. Maybe just... Oh. <laughs> All right, I spoke too soon. No. We need another battery. Uh, I need that copper ingot. I think I made one down here somewhere. I did. Good. Okay. I spoke too soon. Okay, let's get this out of here. Get that battery out. Um, there's the charged battery. Two forty-one. I need to just tack a little bit. Uh, 
There it is. There it is. <laughs> Sweet. Man, we should sail past that thing at some point because I actually... I'm coming back the same direction I... I think it's the same direction I was headed before. Oh, come on. All right, we don't need this thing on because I can see it now. Whoa, check that thing out. It's huge. Oh, they've got, like, windmills and everything on this thing, which means they probably have power. You know, outside of the makeshift battery that I made. Is there a particular side we have to dock on this thing? How do I get onto it? Looks like there's a lower level, so if we can kind of park out there, maybe we can make our way onto it and go check this thing out. That's pretty sweet. And just as a bird flies in. <laughs> I think, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to try and get onto this lower level over here. Be careful, this thing actually moves really fast in this direction. If we could pull it in close here, I can jump on from the back of the boat, actually. Uh, okay, let's get the anchor down. Sweet! It's super noisy right now because of all the waves and stuff, but... Oh, no, I missed. Oh, no, I'm, I'm barely on. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, what have we got in here? What mysteries will we find? Lockers that we can't open. That's that's impressive. Table. I guess I can't take any of this stuff? What's going on? Pick up scrap. Well, we found scrap. Come on, there's got to be something noteworthy here. Like, why send us all the way out here using this special radio thing? Oh, there's a phone. Can we call for help? Call for help! No. Desk lamp? All right. Uh, I guess our only option is to go upward. Looks like this place has already been raided. If somebody built these little like, crazy ramp things to get up here. Vine goo and stuff in there. Nothing really fantastic. Oh, I lost my flippers. Yeah, that's why I haven't been swimming as fast. <laughs> Those are kind of important. Um, how do I get any higher on this thing? Oh, we got to get over there. Uh, oh, I see. They must have put these things here so you can jump on them. There we go. Whoops. <gasps> Is it? Oh, it almost looks like a kitchen. I was like, wait, are they going to have food? They don't have food. Not that I'm all that, all, I'm not really all that bad off for food at the moment anyway, but plastics. Who needs plastic? I can find plenty of that in the ocean. Come on. Give me something I can't get on the ocean. A crate full of junk. Stairs? Killing me here. Come on. Give me something good. There's a level I can't, I can't get up to up here. Uh, but it looks like I can walk across a beam from there if I can get up onto this thing. Oh, here we go. Broken stairs. No. That was not... That was foolish. Okay, right, you can walk on these little eye beams, I guess. That'll work. There we go. They have like a uh, like satellite dishes at the top there. Maybe we can radio for help. Try to get a rescue or something. Is this how we get rescued? All right, up onto here, I guess. Wait, is there? No, that's empty. No door to get in that one. Come on. It's getting so dark. The shark's gonna eat. Oh, what is this? Is it? Are we in like a water world kind of situation? That looks like a city that's been flooded. Where? Utopia? People? Safe? 
Breaking news. All ice will melt. Scientists estimate two years. Water levels expected to rise several hundred meters. Australia completely covered in water. The Earth in 2028 is supposed to have very little landmass by the looks of it. And I guess that's maybe what happened. So that would explain why there's so much junk on the water. It's not even so much that... Oh, that, that shark's going to eat my raft. Rotten shark. It's not even so much that there was like a plane crash or something and we survived and we built the raft to, to survive out here. The whole world flooded. But maybe we can find this utopia place. It's... He's got some sort of a marking on a map, but... Where? H something. But we don't have a map. I wonder if the radar will take us somewhere else now that we have a different target. Maybe we can find Utopia somewhere else? Find the safe people? I don't know whether we will or won't, but um, when we come back next time, we're going to head off with our raft, uh, and we'll try and see what we can find. Maybe we can find something that will point us in the direction of Utopia, and we can try to try to rescue ourselves. Find a little bit more about what happened in this crazy water world. That's insane. That was I was not expecting that at all. <laughs> I haven't been watching anyone else play the game. So this is like no spoilers for me. Super cool. Anyway, I'm going to call it a wrap for tonight. We'll come back another time. Thanks everyone for checking out the video. I'm as always Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.